Okay, so this is definitely one of those spectacles uh, once a year where they remove all cars. It's announced everywhere you cannot park your car here. But people just don't want to believe it. And all the touring companies picking up the damn car. So tomorrow could be another form of summer festival here where you can get cookies and stuff and food bring a little bit of money but you know sometimes they just give it to you for free because it's gonna be more likely um, some kind of a preaching i'm not sure whether i'm right it could be also for a damned film and then you know i mean they don't tell you why all the cars have to be removed but believe it or not nobody believes anything here uh, so the shit is just i mean like the car is just disappearing but this guy is definitely oh okay it's our last guy you know i don't understand why all these veterans of like sign reading it's the collective ignoring look how great now uh, this happens because all the shit disappears and well look how beautiful it is boom now we go and would there be like a back uh, what's called a back thing you know it would be just it would be simply just everything is like written down by the way so you know just like it's not like they just gonna go to the trash you know i mean we are not here in you know i mean it's not here uh which country could i uh, could i insult but believe it or not that shit happens even but some guy woke up you know he gets the point that there's a lot of movement here because already like the entrance is closed over there nobody can come in yeah but it doesn't matter where you can pick up your car you go on the internet you find out some people are gonna like really be fucked up tomorrow morning when they need a car but then next year maybe they remember it but you know some people like just like what happens but i came here look i couldn't see you gentlemen i could not but you know now finally they remove uh, they remove literally all cars thank you so much for this amazing evening it was just amazing because now all the cars are going to be removed this weekend Oh, you got another cerveza. This weekend is going to be uh, like a uh, Fete la Musique. Like, you know, the, it's going to be the street party party fest. So all the people from the neighborhood come out. Yeah, they're making little stands. You can buy dance with your little children. They're having entertainment classes. Why don't I get a job with the pink kids? Oh, it is definitely happening here. The entire block is going to be reserved for the people once a year. And then tomorrow, that's the party. Because if you go through uh, in summer, yeah, I take all the fucking cars, right? yeah, they take them all away. And that costs like 250 or so. Because, you know, when they, they, I mean, it's advocated, you know, very clearly the fucking cars have to disappear. But not a single shit, person, not a single one parked it away. Look, some maniac might even come here and park it one more time. Let me see. He, he cannot be so stupid to yeah, park so his car. Up, right? No, but let me see whether this guy is just parking here. I hope he gets it. No, he got it. He got it, but only because this is like hey! guys. But you know, they don't care, they're making their job, you know, they look everywhere. And, See, and some people tomorrow are gonna come and Yeah, they're to gonna tomorrow. And, Where is my fucking <laughs> Yeah, they will definitely remember last year because it happens every year. 
It's the sixth time I see the spectacle. What is the what is the Harlem party or something? Uh, I I think it is Harlem Street Party. Harlem Street Party. Street, street party. You know, uh, there's a you know the church is uh, you can anybody can ask for a street for a street fair. If you have a lot of artists, well then artists can do. You have do, to show your city. Uh, yeah, I mean, I was thinking I could paint tomorrow here, but then, you know, that would maybe attract, uh, you know, I mean, I could, I did that in the last previous year, I did. I could bring them out for display and park them there, but believe it or not, there are people who just don't give, a, they don't care. I mean, definitely I could explain my work, what I do, and I get maybe 25 more Instagram ladies, but basically, you know, uh, they still will identify me as what? Uh, it's called, they identify me as a gentrifier here, a new arrival here. And so uh, that's why it's always nice to be here a little bit, particularly when you have your own children. I mean, I was here with my children. It was so lovely. I was always here when there was like children party. I bring the children here. In fact, but it didn't happen too often because, you know, after all, I got the children not too often when I was here. But I did get them quite often, you know, I asked them, they came here, I had cats, I had always a little drama, and now I had no drama, you know, I had zero drama. Because sometimes it is so relaxing to not have fucking drama, thanks again for the pizza. And I hope I don't have a drama at night because, you know, my company is completely healthy. But, you know, my stomach, you know, it was fucked up last night. So I hope I, I survived it. But, you know, I, I tell you something, you know, what I never, you know, when you go to Harlem and obviously to all Central America, you see very small kids. You see them like what? Because I'm putting this online now. So children should see what they miss, you know, you know what I mean? I should see that daddy sitting outside, but you know, so basically, right. sit again. Nobody's back here, right? No, no, I have no car. What? I don't have a car. Okay. Don't worry, I mean, I have a bicycle. You saw me coming. <laughs> it's, it's, it's for that party at the end of the week, no? What? Is it for a film or the, for the no, end? No, 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 they're, they're gonna be no, taking up all the asphalt, putting a brand new road over here. Oh no, why? That makes a lot of noise. That's ridiculous. Why? Does oh, we'll the get out of here in one day. Tonight be it. Really? Tonight they'll pay the 10 days from now. Oh my God, 10 days mania. It's just, it's a waste of time. That street is great, gentlemen. I mean, that's kind of what I like. So they start coming in. You start at seven in the morning, no? No, no, we started at uh, nine o'clock tonight. Oh yeah, I mean, oh my God, all night long already. <laughs> Even better. It's. Oh, I understand. <laughs> I appreciate that. It is what it is. Uh, all night you work through, no? Working hard. I know. I, I understand what you're gonna do now. Okay. So, uh, but anyway, the, it's. I think there is still a street party coming up in summer. Maybe it's in August. And we maybe. Need to get a for that. Oh no! I mean, like, did you see a fucking hole in that street? No. But they need to bring it's most likely. Fine, I, do I know, but uh, you know the city has so much money. They just wanna always drive people crazy. But it's gonna be so dusty. I mean, I tell you, uh, summer and dust. At least the COVID. I mean, look, they're waiting already. They're gonna look at. They all disappear. They just like phrase the shit up. Those huge machine. Oh my God! Yeah. That trash, you know, I have no trash because at this point I wonder even I should put this trash more over there because I don't want to have then that trash mixed here and then they come and give me a fight. Because you know if you know it's I mean look, the point is this there will come a time where suddenly the first snow comes in. And then I have the same nonsense going because if by eight o'clock or I think ten o'clock there is no walkway to uh, cause money or so you will see me get up very early in the morning and make the walkway. And then there are so many people that just don't even do it. And it's fine, but I always do it. Because they pick guys like me. You see 
see like certain people get they have so much heat from the house they're not getting fine. But I just paid one for hundred and thirty dollars because I'm the price of life here. Yeah. What the fuck? So obviously that little trash here went all over but look at it. It's such a yeah I love how they do it. I love it because a machine oh yeah that that you know machine against machine yeah i love it hopefully all the rats in the neighborhood come up here and say hello you know and what the fuck is even that thing out there you know that moving way you know up there logo you know i don't need that you know but you know if it's kind of hilarious that uh, it's gonna definitely be quiet because you know that it's not like the fanciest night. It's, uh, you know, certain things in all night, uh, a lot of noise. But do you want to see that other place? You know, check it out. The place around the corner. But you know, there's a place around the corner on the show. I think I could still hunt it. Go Okay, let's do it tomorrow. Yeah, next time might be maybe Saturday. But thank you so much. I'm always so happy because I just hope that I have enough sleep to sleep to that shit. You know, and they're gonna go like, Arr. but you know, I always loved to show my children all this stuff. But what I want to see earlier is this. You know, you know how in Latin America, but also in other places. Sometimes little children are up to midnight and longer. Oh, yeah. But in Germany, my God, it's like kids will not be sleeping by five o'clock and by nine o'clock. You know, he would kill me. I mean, that was also a reason of our dispute. Yeah, different cultures. She, she would read all this nonsense stuff on the internet, you know, be depressed, but just permanently tell me what to do and what not to do. And then I would like run around. I mean, I never came up that far. We were like, but out where we were, we walked out there. But she was so scared to walk out there. She just saw everybody against her. And I just thought that's so damn racist and shit, you know. I mean, after all. But now the kids know literally what. Good thing is, I know what they do. Because you see, they have this sign I saw when the first sign came to the sign. What they're gonna do, they go now in and they check some of the meters. So I just hope they don't come. I hope they don't have to come into my fucking house and mess with my, uh, you know, with my pumping system. Because that would be obnoxious, obnoxious, you know. But then on the other hand, you know, I also like when people are on the block who have the kind of tools to open that shit up. I mean, you know, that shit is so hard to open up here, right here. To, to open this shit up, you need to have work for the fire department, otherwise you don't even know how to open it. And, um, uh, you know, I mean, there's always a party over there in case, you know. <laughs> And then it's so damn beautiful, the music, but when you go, it's kind of really lean. You really look wrong in the place, you know? <laughs> <laughs> But, you know, when they have, I mean, this police light there, I was trying to get to know, I mean, when I was having problems with everything, I started to paint middle in, in the middle of the night in the street, you know? So I just to experience a bit of night in the street, to lose a little bit of uh, fear, you know? So I got to know all the people from the project. I spoke at 3 in the morning, 4 in the morning, but I worked like 5 or 4 in the morning. So I got to, you know, it's hilarious, you know. I mean, the clubs and the Italian business stories, you know. And I had them even, so I was painting there. I was painting there and I bought the canvas that's like basically from the police light up to here. And I asked people even to show me how to dance. How to dance. But would you ever think I was able to meet a beautiful girl like just taking in here? No way. There was no way to do that. So not only that, when I started writing, I know I had the music that I didn't want to fall asleep. Sometimes it's really quiet, so 
I put in sex machine, all like sex machine. And then it started to fall out. And then, and then they were so annoyed that I was over there because, you know, the action is over there, those men, you know, it's like the action. So I was in that turf. I didn't, you know, I mean, you know, the point was the guy was so upset that I was here in the five o'clock in the morning. You know. At one point, you know, they came and just took, I mean, I used paper because the time was mostly too expensive. So they just came with a bucket of water. Everything, you know, but it was all like it was all, it was all like you take get the fuck out of here, you know. Sex machine, and then I said, Well, what are you gonna do? You wanna kill me here? You know, I mean, like that kind of, you know. And then he came with the water, so I put up some resistance because I thought, you know, this is not that. You know what they told me? They told me, You have to go to the northern side. So they, there was always this tagging of the police. Look how beautiful, how beautiful that guy dances, you know. <laughs> I love that in particular. That's kind of a ballet dance, you know. It's like a, so. It's hard to do that shit. Uh, yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. It's, it's like literally what I did with the bike and have three people sitting on my bike. The entire family was on my bike because I just like to sleep so long in the morning, you know. And then in order for the kids to be in the school so fast, you know, I just had everything prepared. The last night, I put them on the bike, one in the front, one in the back, and I raced snow during the sun always drop them off on time in the fucking little kindergarten now it's free but at the time it cost so much money I have no idea so it was always bleeding money I have no idea how much bleeding money and the stress you know you never work you never work you never work you know I mean just she just only Well, but then, you know, eventually, you know, after paying her all these classes, my God, I learned so much from learning criminal law in the United States and American history. And it's not like I wasn't already aware of national history but you know the discussions were for times really uh, exciting were really good but you know there was what's really I was annoying was when there was like the guy who lives up there with his mother and the two little children he liked me came out in the middle of the night a rapper he liked me you know he has my Instagram and now guess what when I came from the YMC there like I came in the morning it's just like boom he said he did the mood, I mean the medicine and his skateboarding and all. But he was really like far. He would I mean the skateboarder I liked because I had him like rap on it, you know, like after all, you know, hours, two hours we talked and so on. And then he said on one of my Instagram I used the N-word, which of course I would have used the N-word. I mean that makes no sense. But even if I did, I didn't do it consciously. And even if I did. I mean, this is not like, you don't kill somebody for that. And then also, I apologized to Miller when he told me. So there was like always a little bit, he got very aggressive, I asked why he was aggressive suddenly, you know, and he was like really getting more aggressive. And I always enjoy, apologized, I said, no, I didn't do it, I didn't do it, I'm sorry, I didn't do it. And then I came and he was over there, rapping to the community here, you know. And then he just ran off to me. He jumped, you know, I mean, it was completely like, I was in pieces, but that would never happen to you, obviously, because you know what I mean, we just... So the entire street kind of knows me as a local man, because, you know, they go in and out, you know what I mean? I mean, so many people know me, and then when I had the opera, they called, uh, then James, I mean, I played James Bond, I always picked different music, opera, Carmen, they like this, but then they called the police. They called the police. The police was constantly coming and saying, like, what's wrong? You know, I'm just painting here. You have to go here. You have to go here. I'll go on your side. No, and then they, I couldn't even be here anymore. So I had to work down there. So I worked for a moment down there. And again, so I fucked that chick and I ended up painting the kitchen, you know. And that's still kind of, because I got so many imitations to the police the precincts because if you go to that precinct it's all the way down there if you go on the north I go to another precinct <laughs> the precincts are in the middle you know what I mean 
but that one is pretty much heavy and that one is more shit but you know sometimes they having like more like downtown people a little bit it's getting also better but you know uh, the better one was obviously the one on fifth avenue that one you like 107 but you know when you sit around in those cells because i was sitting in these cells you listen to a lot of crazy stories and all i do is to remember a little bit telling it to you and this shit goes now on your yeah, youtube channel because you know one day you know I, mean, I don't give a shit one day the kids can see it i don't think necessarily i said something wrong did you say something wrong because i have no name here i mean the mama of the kids you know that is obviously everybody knows so far and uh well she not sure she's aware i do this every night but if she wants to go through all my videos I and mean, that is a long video because they are so long it's already like you know my videos are usually so like uh, 45 minutes an hour just talking so you know if somebody wants to see that good luck you know? good luck i mean good luck and uh, well now uh, you I totally consider you my friend here and I know from any psychological position I mean from any anything we study it's good to have friends and to talk no totally always and we don't even have to mention your name or all the things you know associated with you no way i'm no way i mean forget about it you know i just don't know anything you know but doesn't it look good like it looks also like a party party car there over there you know you know the d d d d d but they are really but believe me, one moment they're gonna come in with those like grrr, go down. And then they're gonna put they're putting new pipelines, they're putting new lights in them. It's called the internet. They're putting more internet, it's, it's like Biden's infrastructure plan, you know. Because after all, everybody wants to be busy, you know. They fix it before it all collapses. But you see, it's so nicely made that in the middle it goes a bit up, it comes down. That's a perfectly made street. I just hope it's not gonna end up all the shit landing on my court. <laughs> and I would pay quite a bit of money to have that shit removed because because of that, I mean, everybody sees always what's wrong with my with my with my yeah, with my lot. So the people like they have car in front of him, they they never get kicked because you can't see the shit behind the cars, you know? Because the sanitation car comes in at about, they, they, are, they are allowed to look at, at, at the shit, something like around, it's called eight in the morning, but not 10 to eight. And I wake up, I had the alarm 10 o'clock, because I was just too stupid annoyed to always pay those hundred dollars and now it went to 130 because so far so all the COVID years I just couldn't pay but you know the next thing they said to me if you're not gonna pay the 130 it's gonna be 400 next time if I paid 130 you know because you can't always send it back you, you, you know what I mean And I mean, some people can, uh, uh, economic conditions can call it that's a pleasure, but I call this literal shit. You know, when you can't pay your things, you know, that's much more. And you better have a family or you have somebody else, you know. I don't be helping you with this. If you ever have a problem with something, I'll come. Like let's say if you uh, fall, you skateboard, since you are obviously the best skateboard star in the neighborhood, then you know I you just have to let me know you're in some of the hospitals, I come visit you. <laughs> but then when you go to the hospital it's very hard to get to you because they would say what relationship is. You know, a friend 
No, I think you cannot find it. But maybe. Uh, this is the guy who I like him. He goes, he makes all his money going to the church in Africa. Hello! His car is so pretty parked away. He smells the problem. He smells the problem. Yeah. He might get rid of the shit earlier. I might sneak it back and I hear it. I don't think it's going to be. Nothing really in it. Oh, he takes the ball for him. He has a spoon. He has a huge. He has a church here, not a good church. He, he flies to real Africa and he is like a star over there performing real African American like rituals. And always tries to be, bring some students here and he goes there and gives them the gospel of the African church in Harvard which they think goes back to like, uh, I don't know, the Mayflower. <laughs> I totally don't know the Bongo shit, you know, but they see so many films, you know what I mean? They see so many films, they read so many Malcolm X, they read so many like those books, you know, about African liberation in America, that they meant to have its own African church. He's a lawyer in the league, by the way. He makes all kinds of other money. But in summer, he goes to Africa. They fly him there, he gets literally paid. He serves the African community here, the church. That's what I mean, the churches have always so much money. How are you? I hope you took your car away because now they are gone. You know, they take all the cars away because they're gonna rip everything open. Did you park a car here? No. If you parked here a car, well, by now it might be gone. But that means like tonight they're gonna work, rip everything out, you know. That woman was lucky. <laughs> Some people are so lucky, you know, but others are not lucky at all. And I think 30 minutes, look at all these amazing silhouettes. Is she also having a car and parks away now? The lady over there? I like silhouettes, no? Particularly when I have some feeling in the morning all the invoices are gone. But it starts up again, so I, I stop this now.